Welcome back to the channel, everybody. It's Zach with Money Pit RC. We're gonna just do a little bit of crawling on this little rock pile over here with the Axial AX24. I just put a camera on my head. Hopefully we can just talk a little bit while I do some crawling. I've had this thing for about a week now and it's been impressive ever since. Uh, it was probably stock for a couple days and I just had to modify it. I didn't really do too much. I mean, people would say that it's really modified, but it, it's really not. The main thing are just the year racing aluminum axle housings. But other than that, it's just got brass diff covers brass knuckles and it's running the four millimeter plus axles just to give it a little bit more wider stance and then of course we got some little guy racing swamp king tires but i run those on everything but you can just see this thing just moves over anything anything that you throw at it Maybe you guys will enjoy this type of video. Maybe you won't. Who knows? Look at that. Um, I do want to change out the motor. Maybe do a Fury Tech brushless system. I don't know if I've seen anybody do it yet. I'm sure people have. But I would like to just to give a little bit more smoothness. But, I mean, for what it is, it's amazing. Out here, oh, oh no, save it, saved it. Out here in Pennsylvania, it's one of the nicest days here in February. It's almost 60 degrees. I'm currently just in a t-shirt. <laughs> As yesterday, it was rainy and 30 degrees. So I figured this would give me a good opportunity just to come out, just to give this thing a little crawl on the rocks. Uh oh, I don't think I'm. Don't know if I could save it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, almost. I just love how easy it is to operate the rear wheel steer. Just a flick of a button. I'm gonna turn it off. Just have a normal, normal mode right now. Hopefully the wind's not too bad. Hopefully you guys can still hear me and not get annoyed with the wind. Gonna try to stand out of the wind. We're gonna come over here. See if we can go up this line. So do you guys have an AX24? And if you do, what kind of mods do you have on it? I want to know what, what everybody's doing with these things. Man. This thing just goes. Wherever you want it to go, it'll go. Adding the brass weight really helped keeping the thing planted. I know when it was stock, it had a lot of issues trying to keep all four wheels on the ground but I mean you put a little brass on the bottom uh -oh. might be might be wedged there we go nice I might put some uh, like closer views of just little bit of crawling but if not 
this is what you're gonna get. <laughs> Let's, uh, we'll go this way. seeing this thing articulate over anything is what it's all about honestly all right we'll put the rear wheel stand I tried to film one of these the other day and the wind was just too bad. You could barely even hear anything. So hopefully today it's a little better. There's a little stream down there. That's usually where I go for like my one tenth crawlers. I mess around in the stream. See if we can come down over here. Actually, I don't know if the sun's in the way. So we're gonna come back over here. Probably do a different line. I did have to I don't know if you guys watched my last video about this. I did change out the motor to an Enduro 50 turn, the purple one. I just didn't know if I maybe had one defective motor out of the box. I know a couple people had one, but like I said, I ran maybe two battery packs through it and the, it just died. See if we could sneak around this. Oh, I don't think there's no coming back from that. Dang it. <laughs> I talk all this good stuff about it and all I do is flip. See, I, I put myself in those situations. I just climb right over it. Let me know in the comments if you think, uh, if you wanna see more videos like this. I don't mind doing videos like this keeps it simple if you'll enjoy just watching it crawl do a little bit of talking man Let's see if we can make it up this try over here let's go over here I'll go up over here a little bit sneak around that rock we'll see if we can not flip again for the hundredth time I think we can make it up Now I'm trying to flip or flip. 
this video is just going to be me uh, picking up the crawler and keep moving it. Hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> Might cut some of that out <laughs> or not. Over here, some of the bigger rocks where I usually bring my base camp, mess around on. Oh, right into the servo. Nice, right up and over. I keep getting pinched. Did that. Uh oh. See, like right there, like any type of restriction, it just cuts out. I don't know if I got an ESC problem or what. Thing just eats rocks, if you know what I'm saying. All right, we'll do a little bit of without the rear steer on. Leave the rear steer off, see what we can do over here. Maybe we can go up this, up around. See, like right there, look. I don't know. Like I said, I just don't know if it's just, I don't have any other issues with any of my other crawlers like that. And like I said, nothing's, nothing's too tight. Wheels aren't tight. I just have no, no wheel spin. here see what we can do over here or flip <laughs> bringing that back bringing the old flip back very nice Sun's coming out, which is really nice. It feels really good. Wonder who that is. All right, guys. I think I'm gonna end the video here. Let me know if you like videos like this. If not, I won't do another one. If you do, just give it a like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next video.